General Hospital spoilers for Monday, July 22, expect Spencer Cassidine's name to be mentioned again. That's when Jocelyn Jacks handed over the pigeon statue to Trina Robinson. Trina once again missed Spencer and wanted to see him, but Trina knew this was impossible and had to accept the erasure of Spencer's name in her mind. Even Spencer's relatives no longer hope to see Spencer again, some of them will soon say words of comfort to Trina when they see Trina in tears again. However, some surprises will soon come for Trina, it seems that Jocelyn will be the one to find some new information regarding Spencer. Turns out he's still alive and GH writers want to bring the character back early this August. Meanwhile, Laura Collins shed tears while visiting her daughter, Lulu Spencer. Laura made this visit with Dante Falconeri, they hoped that Lulu would open her eyes. However, that was just a vain hope. Dante even said that if Lulu really woke up and became a vegetable for life, it shouldn't be done. Dante is able to crush Laura's fragile hope, and that makes Laura really angry. Then, to help Laura temporarily forget the sad things, Dante mentioned another story. Unfortunately, Dante made Laura even more sad when he mentioned the story of Charlotte Cassidine. Now, Charlotte and Valentine Cassidine have completely disappeared. Dante goes on a desperate search for them, and Laura doesn't want Charlotte to go on the trip with Valentine. That will directly affect Charlotte's psychology, because Valentine is a dangerous level criminal. James West will also go to Cody Bell's workplace. Tracy Cordemain may have been the one who discovered James was there and was furious. Of course, right after that, Cody will have to take James somewhere else, to avoid Tracy making things worse. Maxie Jones was surprised when James wandered around, of course Maxie and Damien Spinelli also had to face Cody's complaints. That made Maxie start to dislike Cody's treatment of the people around him. Spinelli will be the one to calm Maxie when the real clash of Maxie and Cody potentially occurs. James can then mention that James wants to help Cody and Max Scorpio mend their relationship. James really wasn't capable of doing that but at least James tried to help Cody even though James' approach was quite immature. Cody then regained composure and realized that he had mistakenly blamed James. Cody wanted to apologize, but it seemed things did not go well. Sasha Gilmore will also be a bit angry by her boyfriend's outrageous actions. But Sasha understands that Cody may have been under too much pressure recently, perhaps that's why Cody has negative thoughts. Meanwhile, Giovanni Palmieri and Tracy will also have a chat. Exactly, Gio was the one who heard about the problems related to James, and Gio was trying to calm James down. Thanks to what Gio is doing, Tracy begins to feel that Gio is really attractive. Tracy could be the one to give Gio a different future in town, but many other predictions suggest that Gio will also likely leave town before the end of the summer. Finally, Jason Morgan will have a heartfelt conversation with Carly Spencer. Jason officially wants to return to work for Sonny Corinthos, in fact Jason's purpose is to protect Sonny. Jason knew something bad must have happened to Sonny at this point, but it was difficult for Jason to win back Sonny's trust. So after that, Jason was even more determined to work for Sonny again. Jason's first mission will most likely be to investigate what happened to Sonny's drugs.